It's your girl, Sierra. Don't get it wrong. Spell my name right. It's C apostrophe A I R A. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today is Face Mask Tuesday, okay? So, for this week, um, because my birthday was Saturday, I ended up going to Target and I ran across a couple of different face masks that I haven't even tried before. Um, this one is by Q Bella Professional. This one is for illuminating. Um, it has rose, quartz, glitter, and it's a peel-off mask. Um, it's enriched with rose quartz. So this one is dermatolo... Dermatolo... <laughs> This one is dermatologically, logically, derma, derma, dermatologically tested. <laughs> Y'all, one big word. <laughs> Anyways, so um, I'm gonna use this illuminating glitter peel off mask to help my skin glow. The rose quartz powder helps to remove dead skin cells whilst um, it's light reflective crystals help to soften the appearance of flaws and boost radiance so it, it um, has organic rose water rose quartz gold powder and sodium hyaluron hyaluronate all right so directions cleanse the skin then apply with your fingertips avoiding the hair eyes eyebrows and lips this is great because um i'm gonna forget all right so let's see first thing i want to do is find a hair clip right it's the thing to avoid the hair all right so i always have hair clips hiding around all right so let's move the hair out of the face All right, just gonna cleanse the face. Okay, so I am going to, because my hands are wet now, it's hard for me to open it. There we go. All right. I like my face a little moist, I don't want it to be dry. So I'm just gonna rewet it just a tad bit. Okay. But now my eye wants to start burning. Isn't that something? Alright, so um you're just gonna cleanse the skin, apply with your fingertips. Avoiding certain areas. So I guess I need to push it up. There's all this glitter in it. All right. Oh, this smells amazing. This smells like um, definitely like some some roses. All right, so to avoid the hair and the eyebrows, <laughs> this is kind of hard, you know, like who can, who can, um, who can get around those areas, especially like for people with, um, sideburns, um, people with, you know, hair in the front that, you know, might be just dangling. I don't know. Like I said, it's very, very hard. So 
So I'm going to actually use all of this. And it says avoid the lips. So I'm just working around the lips. I will say I'm glad I went in Target and tried to look for some masks because every, every, you know, every store is different. Um, and I definitely um, think that, you know, these are worth it. Like this one was $2.99. And some of the other ones that I got were $1.99. Um, I guess sometimes it's just hard to tell. I definitely want some under the chin because that's another great spot to put some. That's it. Avoid the lips. I can definitely feel it drying. Um, I'm trying to avoid the eyebrows. I don't know how this is supposed to work with avoiding eyebrows. I do love how soft it is. Like and how much is in here. You can see what happens after <laughs> after the time frame that I need to wait. Okay. So oops. Alright, so this is it. That was all that I had. So now I have to relax for 10, 15 to 20 minutes until the mask is completely dry. Then I'm going to just gently peel it off and remove any remaining product with warm water so see you in 15 minutes all right so it's been i did my timer for 17 minutes i could tell it's time to come off look at that but um <laughs> all right so this is the part where it just starts to get itchy at and you're like you know impatient so Wow, to kind of be able to like get it really gone like within one take. That's amazing. Otherwise you're sitting there peeling small spots for hours. All right. So I got it all up in one peel basically uh just for except for a few spots but they still were connected so the spots that i cannot get up um just have to be wiped up with a towel i'm sorry washcloth <laughs> um so like yeah this was easier than i thought I think one time I did a mask and it was like stuck to my face for a while until I just kept washing it. But I see um I see the parts where they say like, you know, don't don't do the eyebrows and the and the lips and the hair cuz this this wouldn't come out of your hair if you even if you tried. So I got and then you could just take the wrapping and literally like just wipe the rest away. All right. So I'm just gonna wash off the rest. I'm just gonna wash off the rest. So I think that I really do like that. 
I like that it had the glitter. I like the smell. I like that I can peel it off within 15 to 20 minutes. And I like the fact that like right now, my face really does feel smooth. And I can still smell it afterwards. I like that. And it doesn't leave glitter on my face after um, we're done. So now I can take this out. So yeah, it doesn't leave glitter on my face. My face doesn't feel rough, feels smooth. I still can smell the rose quartz and there's no glitter stuck to my eyebrows or the front of my hair. Okay, Cubella, I like that one. I like that one. See you next week.